So I was sat on this table thinking that I'd lucked out and then a businessman got on the train, uh, uh, same train carriage and came and sat opposite me, just like a standard businessman, you know, the kind of type who's sort of uh, bald head suit, dead behind the eyes. All he had with him was a catering sized bag of Bombay mix. <laughs> Uh, listening to someone eating Bombay mix at regular intervals for two and a half hours when you physically can't leave because you don't want to interrupt this man's special Bombay mix time. <laughs> what are you supposed to do? Uh, I tried to be encouraging. Uh, I did all the things that I, as an autistic person, have been taught to do on how to interact with other people. I maintained eye contact for the whole journey. <laughs> until he got too uncomfortable <laughs> and moved to one of the very empty seats in the whole of the rest of the carriage. There were so many of them. Why did he sit opposite me in the first place? 